Hi guys, it's that time of the week, Galaxy S4 ROM of the week. Let's go do this, baby. All right, guys, I've got Dirty Unicorns ROM running on my GTI 9505. Uh, this is Android 6.0.1 Marshmallow. All right, this is Dirty Unicorns ROM. I really like it. This is only available for GTI 9505 for those of you with AT&T, T-Mobile, Verizon, and Sprint. I will have another ROM shortly here later today. Um, but if you have a GTI 9505, you will be able to install this ROM and enjoy all the benefits of Dirty Unicorns. This is basically standard Android 6.0.1 ROM. You'll get all the standard features of 6.0.1, including DOS, uh, all of the customizations that offer storage. You can go ahead and add a micro SD card if you want to convert it into um, internal storage. So if you add uh, like 64 gigabyte, you'll be able to turn the 16 gigabyte into what, 92 gigabyte. I can't do math right now. Um, something like that. So that's really cool. Uh, if you insert the SD card, it will give you the option. It will ask you. So that is really nice. Or just go into settings and go into storage options. Installation is pretty much straightforward, but let me go ahead and show you the meat of this ROM. If you go into dirty tweaks, this will uh, where you will find all the cool tweaks that you can do. All right, I'm not gonna go through all of them, but let me go ahead and show you some of the cool stuff. Um, there's a ton of lo uh, lock screen shortcuts you can add. Bottom, left, right shortcuts. You can go ahead and customize these, I think. Where we go? Reassign, tap an icon, there we go. Um, so I can go ahead and change this to any app I want. Let's say I want Chromium. I don't want the camera. Uh, I want something like a calendar. There we go. That will give you bottom left right left right shortcuts. Go to middle um, mid screen shortcuts. Sorry, sorry, I have a hard time reading. Too high on Android. Um, you can go ahead and add different shortcuts. You know here that will be in your middle of the screen. So let me go ahead and show you my lock screen now. Um, you will see that I have Chrome that I can go ahead and open straight up from the lock screen. And also I can do a double tap on the camera to open the camera. I mean, you can customize the way you want to. Um, you can also even change uh, how you open it. You can do a click long press. That work. There you go. Uh, there's even lock screen wall configuration. Um, there is a lock screen torch press, uh, long press power button. And I, I don't think this actually works. So when your lock screen's on, do a long press. Nope. Uh, I think this actually feature is broken. I was trying it earlier and, oh, it does work. Yeah, boom shakalaka, that's awesome. So when your screen's off, just go ahead and hold down the power button and, uh, wait, wait. When your screen's off, you, uh, when you're going in the garage or something and you have a lot of uh, was it those black widows and you don't want to run into them, then just grab into your pocket, hold down the power button. Uh, hold on, let me try that again. Yeah, it's working. So what I did is because this case makes it hard to press the power button. That's why I keep, I think, actually hitting it. If your screen is off, absolutely off, Right, and hold down the power button. Yeah, hold down the power button. Work, bitch. All right, there you go. It worked. Um, it's a little tricky. Maybe just not use it. All right, but it's there. That's kind of cool. Lock screen torch. Um, so you get the idea. You can also put weather widgets. Let me go ahead and show you what's really cool. Some extra stuff. Um, battery carrier label. Um, there's this time contextual header. Turn this on, use poly ASD images, and you get this nice random image that matches the time of the day. Uh, I thought that was really cool. So you can do that with this ROM. Uh, clock and date, you can go ahead and move the clock to the center like I did, and you can, you know, put AM, PM, small font size. If you have a hard time keeping track day of the week, like myself, because I work at home, you know, I don't go to work. Uh, I work at home, so this helps me keep track of the day. Um, you can even change the, the date style if you want it lowercase, if you want it uppercase. All kind of little BS features you probably would never need, but this ROM has it. Uh, it's dirty. All right, status bar items. You can go ahead and change 4G uh, into LTE if you want. You can go ahead and hide stuff that you don't need uh, really quickly there. 
And I believe you can actually, no, you can't customize it from that far. All right, notifications. Um, there is a ton of different ways you can read your notifications with Android 6.0. Um, you get these default on the top, but you can go ahead and disable them. Force expanded notifications, uh, breathing missed call, all that awesome, awesome stuff. All right, traffic indicator. If you have, if you install a lot of like apps, you know, and you, you know, sometimes have trouble and maybe you install a wrong app that starts installing a bunch of apps, you can monitor all that traffic especially if you're not on Wi-Fi, um, you can tell exactly how much data is being received and sent from your phone. So that's what the traffic indicator is great for. A lot of uh, flashaholics like myself will use that. If you need soft keys, you can go to navigation bar, add buttons here, All right, navigation mode, fling gesture interface. I have no idea what that is. Oh, that's so cool. Um, so you can do these flings. I, I'm not sure how to use it, but <laughs> I just found out. Um, so they have different things that fling settings. Let's go into fling settings. All right, right short swipe, default action. Oh, so you can do different actions. So uh, let's do to the right. Let's do the flashlight. No, it's not working. All right, um, so you can kind of mess with it and get cool features. Oh, oh, you know what? That's why I got to do a short one. There you go. Look at that. That's that's so awesome. All right, you can do right long swipe and um, maybe menu button, power button, let's say. So right long swipe will always give you that. So a swipe menu interface, that is really, really cool. Fling gesture interface. Um, tap gesture, single tab left. So instead of having the traditional buttons, now you can go ahead and get these fling gesture interface. Um, look at all this customization you can do. Um, so that is really cool. And if you don't like that, you can always go ahead and change it back. I mean, if you want, you can go ahead. I think this is a great idea. You can use your hardware buttons and then use the fling buttons to enable the flashlight or add your cool stuff so that I just found that out so that's that's really cool um so definitely check that out that one feature alone is worth installing this ROM uh, multitasking um, there's app circle bar gesture anywhere uh, multi window omni switch I will not go into this all this um, but you can try it out I'll look at multi window real quick I was using this earlier if you want to do multi window while taking uh photos let's try if that works so i've got my camera on there let me go ahead and go to my recents i'm gonna go ahead and open up the twitter hit that button switch up hit it again and i'm gonna put this in the multi-window nope camera oh might work all right so i got settings working here you know, you probably won't use that no it's working there we go the camera sort of you should not use a camera. I'm just showing an example that you shouldn't do. Um, but basically you get the idea. You can get multi-window. All right, there is a ton more features, but I don't want to get into it, um, all of it, but you can go ahead and check it out. But I really like this ROM, a lot of dirty tweaks. It is also available for many, many other smartphones. So just go ahead and Google, um, you know, if you want to ch check it out, if you have a Note 2, Note 2, uh, dirty unicorns marshmallow ROM. You should find it. Uh, but I will also do a review with other phones after I check it out. But looking pretty good. This is actually my GTI 9505. I just got the back from my AT&T. Getting kind of long. Have a great day, folks. Try this ROM. I'll have another ROM if you don't have a GTI 9505. Stay tuned. Hit the thumbs up. Uh, have a great day. And as always, stay Click here to subscribe.